Hello YouTubers. Um this is a tutorial or not so much of a tutorial but showing of my DLL file that I made. If you would like this, just PM me and I'll send it to you. Um all right. So after I send it to you, you get a file like this. You want to right click, cut you want to go to your Windows directory and then paste it in here. I already have it in here, so I'll just replace it. And then you can close that now. You want to open up. You want to open up a, a previous or a brand new one. Form, Windows form and go down to general or that's where I normally go and choose items just takes a little while and then go to your browse button then you want to go to your Windows directory so um, And the name of the thing's custom right there. And now it's added. Click OK. Alright. Now to use it, you just put it on there. Alright. What I like about this is very, very customizable. And I've made this all by myself. So what you want to do is get rid of the regular form. Windows form. Um, so you go to none, and now if I put the background oops, background color to black, <laughs> doesn't look that good because all these are black. All right, you can change each button individually colored or you can change them all at the same time when by putting them transparent so if I make these all transparent and I go up here and change this it'll change all the buttons at the same time but if I want to have say the maximum button button green oh shoot I'm sorry green oops <laughs> um blue and I want the minimize button to be red now I can do that um or say that this application I don't want to have a maximum button um I can make it not there which that's a bug and I didn't realize that which if you do do something like that you want to set the background oh, I've been doing that transparent so that the space that the buttons not there anymore will be gone you won't see it and if you want the minimize button gone same idea you just go down set it false so now you have just the X which the back the color of it is going to be green and then if I run this I can close the application but see, it gives you an error because I did not specify what form. Which, if anybody could help me with this, um, be real great help because I only way right now I'm doing that to add the form is doing it that way. And I know there's got to be a different way to do that, but I can't. I don't know how, and the code behind this. 
none, apparently. Um, alright, so that's okay. Um, but it still works. If I have the form selected, now it works. And all the rest of the buttons work too, so let me bring them back. Um, true, true, okay. And if I do that, maximum button. Of course, you got anchor in the corner, but minimize button. And exit button. So if I anchor this down in this bottom corner. Maximize it. Stays right in the bottom corner. Same idea with the top corner or any other corner. You minimize it. You minimize it. Exit. It exits. All right. Um. But this is very customizable. And if you would like this, just PM me, and I'll thank you. I'll send it to you. And thank you for watching.